head towards London's Oxford Street, one of the world's most famous shopping streets and a hotbed for scammers. If you go onto the website to buy this, it's not cheap, it costs £40 to buy. Expensive. In Oxford Street, you only pay half price. You pay only £20 for this one. But because we're closing the store now, guys, today you get everything else to go with it in the bag, over £185. Everything else is completely free of charge. Is that OK? I'll no wonder there's a crowd. This guy is giving away a bag full of perfume for just 30 bucks. The crowd are lapping it up. But let's see what you get for free. Well, as I suspected, not everything there is quite as it seems. First of all, he's offering free perfume, but then when it comes to it, you have to buy one to get the others free. And then when you do buy them, they're not even the perfumes that he was advertising. But what makes me really suspicious are all those other people that were buying perfumes at the same time. They can't all be genuine customers, can they? Yeah, it's not you want one. Free. Here we are, guys. Free. Free. Some of these customers Free. have a familiar look about them. You're back again. Free. Free. You're here again. Free. You work for this guy. I don't want something yeah. to, get, to get two or three. Do you want to talk to me about it? Come talk up. to me about it. We want everybody to get ah. up, all of you. Do you get like commission or does he pay you a wage in. or what? Come, come in guys. Get moving in to the lights up. Come in guys. You're not taking your uh not taking not taking your perfume with you? No bro, I work here bro. So you just stuff. pretend you just pretend to buy it? Yeah. Just to get other you people. You're a free worker you. Okay. So you pretend to buy it to get other people to to think that it's a real deal. Oh, yeah. I'm just I'm just interested in in kind of how this how this works. Yeah. Because obviously I'm watching people pretending to buy stuff from you. Yeah. And uh, turn out the back. In the front. Turn out the front. Yeah. Fragrance from ocean on the back. Yeah. We're not hiding nothing from nobody. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's not it's not completely honest though, is it? What's dishonest about it? Then? Well, if people are pretending to buy stuff. They're not. They're they're what you call uh, crowd encouragers. We're not breaking any laws, mate. We're not oh. selling heroin on people, we're selling perfume on them. At the same time, they're still pretending to, to buy perfume, aren't they? To encourage other people to buy perfume. Well, it's, like, and it's, a bit, it's, a bit, you know, it's a business, isn't it? If you go to a wedding and there's a buffet, nobody wants I to be the first one in. For. No one wants to be the first one in the queue, do they? As soon as one person goes in, next minute everyone's in behind them. In life, mate, we're all sheep, all of us, you, me, everybody. We're all sheep. Simple as that. I'm also giving everybody a very nice free bag to carry it home in. Well, a good old-fashioned bit of British showmanship is how they see it. We're just putting it on for the tourists, mate. It's an old business and it works. And oh my God, they must sell a good bit of perfume to be paying the rent on that place. <laughs>